it's been a fortnight since the hijab controversy erupted in the state of Karnataka. It has also become a massive political issue, which has led to a face-off between the BJP and the Congress in the state of Karnataka. Now, the Bharati Janata Party, in fact, has put out some pictures uh, over the years of the class functions of the student assembly sessions that took place where no hijab is visible in these pictures and the big question is then how come all of a sudden you had students wearing hijab protesting against their rights being violated from being stopped uh, from entering the classrooms wearing those headscarves. Absolutely, these four pictures we are showing you. This is the issue of the past few days. It is going to be a lot of pressure on this issue. And this issue is at this time court dekh raha hai court is par kya apna faisla dega is par bhi nazar teki hui hai wahi dekhiye mantri bol rahe hain vardi na pehnne wali chhatraein dusra vikalp talash sakti hain chhatraein keh rahi hain ki humne koi aaj se hijab pehnna nahi shuru kara hum saalon se pehnte aa rahe hain abhi ekdam se kyun dikkat hone lagi kal to humne tasveere dekhi ek saffron patka apne gale mein dalkar ladke campus के अंदर दाखिल होते हैं साफ प्रशासन की तरफ से कॉलेज एडमिनिस्ट्रेशन की तरफ से कहा गया है कि कक्षा में बैठकर कक्षा में आप ऐसे नहीं बैठ सकती हैं हिजाब पहनकर या इस तरह के सैफ्रेंड पटके पहनकर आपको कक्षा में इजाजत हम नहीं देंगे आप परिसर में पहनिए आप कैंपस में पहनिए वहीं आप देखिए बमई सरकार ने शनिवार को एक परिपत्र जारी किया था और उन कपड़ों पर प्रतिबंध लगा दिया गया था जो राज्य के शैक्षणिक संस्थानों में शांति सौहार्द और कानून व्यवस्था को बाधित करते हों Ask you why we should not wear a hijab. Is there is something rule? When we had joined the college first, in that college rules books they have mentioned we can wear a hijab and there is no restrictions about hijab. Then again, certainly, suddenly, why they are telling about we should not wear a hijab? We should not come to college by wearing hijab. Why? Due to the elections, they are telling that we should ban a hijab. We should not wear a hijab. Why? They said you can't wear the hijab. And they made us sign some forms, kind of something. When we asked them to wear, they said that you have already signed some kind of a form and in that it's written that hijab is not allowed. Then we wore hijab because our seniors used to wear. They have also signed the same thing, right? But they are wearing. And uh, so we wore the hijab and when we went to uh, college, they put it as outside the class. And after that, lockdown took place. That issue was like, it was totally covered over there. Then that thing do, didn't take place. Uh, we were online whole year. And this year when we came, we got to know that the, f the form in which uh, they said that about hijab, it's written in that. But that, nothing was written in that about hijab. इधर इतने राज्य के अंदर चच्चे के ग्रास वगैरह अंदर हिजाब इधर आ इतके यो तो काले जले ये लम मुस्लिम उड़गेरो इधर आ हिजाब में दर्शन बढ़ती तरह अधेरे इतने के नाव सना इधर विरुद्ध नाव और हिजाब दर्शन में इधर नाव से केसर सालना दर्शन कोण्डो काले जी के होती नहीं दर्शन दिवत तो काले जी के इसके नाम में लोगों विरुद्ध आवाज़ दे रहे हैं अधिक रहते कि बड़े के प्रिंसिपल जो तो कि मात्र दे रहे हैं लोगों हिंदू शालन नाकुन बैठो केसर शालन नाकुन बैठो और ये इधरों नाम काले जली इधर सरकार इसके इधर दे रही है एनएन स्मार्ट टीम इधर कुन बैठो सो आज कुछ करा उरा नेक्टेन डिसीजन Vocês this is not related to one particular institution. It's once started, it already spread to whole district as well as whole state. Okay. So, uh, because of this, our management told me to implement the instructions of the management strictly. So as per their instructions, we gave instructions to uh, Muslim students as well as Hindu students. So tomorrow also, as per our, um, the, the instructions of management, we will uh, conduct classes, nothing okay, else. So they were wearing it until now, I mean before this uh, issue, it became an issue? Uh, even earlier they wore the hijab. Other than the Muslim girls who cover their heads, there are Christian nuns, 
who are studying and teaching in educational institutions with a, a particular dress code and the six all over india they are wearing the turban in schools and offices etc if we interpret in that way they are also uh, symbols of religious identity we request all the secular and democratic forces and the civil society at large to come forward against this uh, discriminatory act aapko mai prashna puchna chahta hu police hone ke baad burka pehen kar mai jata hu aisa bol sakta hai kya police hone ke baad police uniform pehna chahiye aisa hi hai aap aapka man mein college ka college aur school ke jana ka ichcha hai to कॉलेज और स्कूल का यूनिफॉर्म पहन करके कॉलेज और स्कूल में जाना मतलब नम कर्नाटक एजुकेशन आक्ट अदर रूल बहुत स्पष्ट सरकार यी प्रोविजन अली एस डी एम कॉलेज आड़ मंडल ऐन अधिकार विचार स्पष्ट अदे सतोल नम सरकार आगे हो शांत का शांति कदल के ऐनू सरकार सतोल एलू पिपालने ना कॉर्ट आदेश बरत अदले मुदे यी क्रम तेजुंत तीर्मान ना हिजा धरू केसरी शाल धरू कूड़ा कॉलेज प्रेमिस आगोद नड़ी यू कूड़ा मकल हेल्ती इडी राज्य अनेक कड़े यो याद कारण शक्ति केस अंत नमकू कमान बंद पोलिस इलाके निर्देशन होते यार तंत्र अोचने नोड़े केसरी शाल हाक बंदू क्लास हिजाब हाक बंदू क्लास हसर शाल हाक बंदू क्लास क्लास बरु पाठ कली शाले यस्त्र प्रिसक्रईबारे अदे हाक अदेरे यदकूश across to deepak makali who's joining us live on the broadcast now deepak uh, given the developments that have come to the fore and the twists that we are witnessing the government of karnataka says that a consent was taken from these students uh, in 2021 especially in the college where the entire controversy erupted the students gave their consent for a uniform dress code and what happened in just 4 months and the big question is is this spontaneous the protest that we are witnessing or has all of this been staged well firstly we should understand that udupi of course is one of the colleges where the issue has been going on there are about 6 students in this particular 8 students in fact in this particular college who've been protesting uh, you know by uh, going to the college wearing a hijab where uh, you know the college administration has made it clear that the hijab is not allowed whereas there are other muslim girls as well who have been attending uh, classes without a hijab in this very same college this is a girls pu college and uh, yes they have of course signed a uh, you know a for consent form as well and they have said there have been many seniors who wanted to wear it there have been many seniors who didn't want to wear a hijab and that has been followed and that's the reason they continue to follow it because uh, they believe it's their right and it's their religious practice but we have other instances in different colleges of course now it has spread like wildfire in the coastal region itself there are about 5 to 6 colleges where such an incident has been happening i spoke to some of the principals as well uh, some of them on record some of them off record confirmed that hijab has been worn by several of the muslim students sitting in the class uh, for quite some time now and they don't remember the timeline because it has been happening and they say that you know some of the colleges though they don't specifically mention that you cannot wear a hijab or can wear a hijab it has been a customary practice with an understanding between the faculty and the students and the management where no issue has cropped up now they are saying that you know the entire issue since it has been raked up and you know there are emotions flaring uh, they are you know asking right. the women Deepak, not to come uh, with yes, the hijab yes we stay so on with us in fact jyotsna bahut interesting hai ye baat aur ye dono pakshon ko sawal pucha jana chahiye students ko bhi ki agar pehle consent de diya gaya tha to phir ab achanak se hijab ko lekar protest ki aur sarkar ko bhi kyunki agar छात्र पहले से पहन रहे थे हिजाब तो अचानक से दिक्कत की और सरकार में जो शिक्षा मंत्री हैं वहां पर नागेश वो कह रहे हैं कि दूसरे विकल्प आप तलाश सकते हैं इससे जुड़ी बात भी मैं करूंगी अपने सहयोगी दीपक से अभी हम आगे बढ़ते हैं इस बीच देखिए अगर आंखें टिकी हैं तो वो कर्नाटका हाईकोर्ट पर टिकी हैं ऑल आईज आर नाउ ऑन द कर्नाटका हाईकोर्ट विच विल बी हेयरिंग द पिटिशन ओवर द हिजाब राव एज द कॉन्ट्रोवर्शियल इश्यू रिफ्यूज टू 
die down across the state. Deepak is with us on the broadcast. I think you can take a question. Uh, Deepak, Shiksha Mantri is saying that just as the same way in the Sena, you will have to do it too. If you don't want to do it, then you will open the doors for you. Who are you talking about the doors and the doors, Shiksha Mantri? You know, here it's, uh, it's pretty clear at this point in time with the government order that there is going to be... A an opposition from the government itself in terms of wearing a hijab. If the government is given a complete go-ahead that they get to decide the uniform for the next academic year, uh, the BJP government has made it amply clear that hijab or permission to even wear it as a part of the uniform, a similar color to the uniform, is not going to be granted. And th that's pretty evident in the current order that has been passed, which looks like uh, could be interim if there are different directives that come in from the High Court. Uh, today, of course, uh, two petitions are going to be heard, and most of these petitions come from, uh, you know, the girls at the Urpi College, and uh, you know, there, you know, two issues are going to be, uh, you know, discussed whether. Uh, you know, it's uh, it, it is a fundamental right uh, for uh, you know the girls to wear the hijab. ठीक है दीपक आप नजर रखिए अपडेट के लिए वापस लौटेंगे और टाइम्स नाउ की तरफ से छात्रों से यही अपील है स्वाति कि राजनीतिक दलों के हाथों का हथियार ना बने क्योंकि अल्टीमेटली हम देखें तो इन्हीं की पढ़ाई से प्रभावित हो रही है और राजनीतिक रंग लेता जा रहा है मुद्दा और नजर जैसा कि आपने कहा कर्नाटक हाईकोर्ट पर रहेगी कि क्या ये पूरा जो मुद्दा है वंस एंड फॉर ऑल विल इट बी सेटल्ड बाय द कोर्ट विल कीप ऑन ट्रैक द डेवलपमेंट फॉर द मोमेंट अ क्विक ब्रेक